Visual problems in children are more common nowadays. Let us find out the reasons why our children are more prone for visual problems. The first and most important factor is genetic. If there is anybody in the family with short sight, long sight, etc., there are high chances that the child will get the same disease. And it need not be the father or the mother. It can be as far as three generations behind. The important among the modifiable factors that we can address is outdoor activity. A child mostly spending time indoors nowadays, either reading books, watching TV or computer games, has no necessity to develop a far vision. If you take a child in the village, he will be playing among his friends. He'll be, they will be asking him themselves, see the squirrel, see the bird, see that fruit on the tree. In that child, the tendency for far vision to develop is much more because a human being is an evolutionary being. And what we desire only, our body will uh, give, give us. So if there is a desire of the body to see far, then the far vision also will develop. But a child spending time indoors will not have the genetic drive or the evolutionary drive to develop far vision. The second important point is diet. Nowadays, our children are more exposed to chicken or meat-related diet. In chicken, we all know there is a high incidence of steroid injection and eating such chicken will cause myopia or short sight to increase. The ideal diet for a child is mainly consists of high oily fishes, green leafy vegetables and of course carrot. In high oily fish, we recommend that the child has uh, river fishes, not fried but curry. And in green leafy vegetables, we recommend spinach. The third important factor is TV. For TV, it is recommended for a non-LCD TV that you measure the diagonal and the child is sitting seven times that distance further away from the TV. In an LCD TV, it can be brought down to three times. Also, when you watch TV, make sure the child does not sleep on the side on the sofa and see the TV because astigmatism can develop. Also, the TV should not be placed above the line of vision. The last but not the least is computer games. There is no problem with computer games, but our children nowadays play war games and they we watch a lot of bomb explosions, fire, etc. God designed our eye or evolution designed our eye to see a danger like fire or bomb and then run away from it, not to keep looking at it. Even if you take an ex example of volcano, we see it, we run. But our children keep long periods of uh, vision related to uh, war games where they can see bombs, fire, etc. Our eye is not having the processing capacity to get that amount of vision. With all these factors, we can know that there are modifiable factors and non-modifiable factors and the modifiable factors are more. These are the reasons why our children have more of vision problems.